Whoa, I just realized there's a blue whale here. What the hell is this? I'm just there's new fish just chilling. Yeah, we are underneath the uh, my health is going down. Whoa, there's like a, a plesiosaur here. Whoa! Hello everyone, welcome back again to some more Ark. As you can see, we are back again with the prehistoric creatures. And today, we got a few things actually we could do today. Uh, number one being uh, what we did last time. This is the result. We now have more modern type equipment, which I'm kind of curious to see if we can get anything from it. Let me level up you. We've got one level. Let's go with stamina. So today we're going to go and explore the deep oceans today. Let's go and have a look. Let's go, man. Speak. Um, what was that? Is there water here invisible? Yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. What is this? There is a little bit of water there. Huh. That's interesting. Oh, it's leveled up already. God damn. Oh, God. This is going to hinder my vision. All right, here we go. We're going down. Why is my man breathing like that? So as far as I'm concerned, nothing really is in here that can actually kill me. I don't exactly know what I'm looking for, though. That's the problem. I'm cold. Okay, this is probably where the leggings probably might have helped. Well, there's more of these silica pearls here. What are we looking for? We're looking for, like, a cave or something we can go into. There's, there's no oxygen meter. You gain oxygen while submerging a scuba, depending... Tank is depending on its durability. Okay. Uh, I don't know what I'm looking for. I got hypothermia. Okay. This is a... Okay, maybe we might need the leggings. I have made some, like, more polymer and more other stuff. So in case it is, like, a necessity, looking at it, it probably might be. Is there anything in this formation? I think it's cold because I'm, I'm heading over to the cold area. Cave or anything? Stuff is spawning in. What am I looking for? I'm looking for, like, a cave or something. Like, I'm... We're, we're talking... We're thinking of a hole. Just get out of here. Whoa, I just realized there's a blue whale here. What the hell is this? I'm just... There's new fish just chilling. Yeah, we are underneath the... Uh, my health is going down. Whoa, there's like a, a plesiosaur here. Whoa, okay. God damn it, man. All right, we're all right. I'm going to run out of stamina, though. All right, we got to face these guys. Come on. Whoa, kill plesiosaur. Kill the other one. God damn. Woo. All right, we're all okay. We're good. Bro, there's like angular fish. That ain't prehistoric. What the hell? There has to be. There's no way there's like, not like a cave or like an artifact or anything in the ocean. I refuse. But I, I, again, I don't know what I'm looking for. There's, there's clearly something that we need to be able to go. Like, bro, these oceans are so bare. Oh, hi. You guys like to travel in couples, don't you? No match for the mighty croc. Assuming I actually hit you. I got one. Damn. Okay, we're actually taking damage here. This is actually like an issue. This one plesiosaur is actually doing a madness. God damn, god damn man, these plesiosaurs are really difficult, but like, we got a lot of points out of it. I really am hoping I just run into something that like, you know, leads me to a cave, or some kind of like, underwater ruins. Like, look at this, this is just open. There has to be something here, there can't not be. I am literally just swimming around in the ocean with absolutely nothing to my name right now. I am actually almost dead by the way. I am aware of this. This is, uh... I mean, we're leveling up my crocodile quite quickly here with the idea of the ocean, you know, the bit... The, the, these ocean creatures do seem to give a lot of levels, but at the same time, there's nothing really much else here. I don't know if there are any artifacts in the ocean. Are they all on land? I don't know. I am injured, and that's just from the cold. Um... Uh, let me eat some food. Right, let us get out of this ice place. It's the ice place that's doing the madness. God, man, we went far. Hey, if I hold my torch out, I don't get hypothermia, but I do need to obviously stay above the water. I got a lot of gas, though. Look at all that gas. And I still got oil. I actually ran out of wood. Add that to the collection. So, obviously, I've went and got some more stuff. Because, I mean, should my, my original intention, okay, 
was to explore the ocean to hopefully find a cave or something. If I was unsuccessful, which I think I am at this point, probably because I'm almost dead, we move on to the next thing I had in mind, which was the idea of probably messing around with more of this modern stuff, which could potentially, like, if I get refrigerator and air conditioner provides electricity, provides insulation, both heat and cold. So I believe I can use these to make the temperature perfect so I can hatch eggs. We've, we've had a long history of hatching eggs which have either been too hot or too cold. An incubator monitoring up to 10 eggs. God man, mass production. Jesus Christ, man, that's so much stuff. Okay, so I have an electrical generator, straight cable, and air conditioner. Let's turn that off. How big, how big are we sitting? How big are we? Oh my god, it's bloody massive. Okay, so now I put gasoline in there. So now I need this electrical cable, which, how do I? Okay, well I've put, like, there's a wire in there somewhere. So, and an air conditioner, eight. Uh, I don't know which way it's gonna be facing. Oh, this is, this is gonna be it, this is gonna be, can I, no, I wanna pick it up. It's not in the right place. Pick up air conditioner, okay. This is so awkward, because I don't know which side is which. Right, if I just stick it here. Where does it face? Okay, it faces here, unpowered. What happened to my electrical cable? Do I need an electrical outlet, an outlet for an electrical grid when connected to a generator? Oh, so I need that. I need metal and wood. I've got no metal. Hang on, I've been cooking metal. I don't know why, but we need wood for electricity. Interesting. Okay, so I have an outlet and I have another cable. Let's see how this goes, shall we? Turn that off. Ah, okay. I think I'm doing it. So now, if I power this, that's now powered. Amazing. Okay, so then if I go and grab this egg, it should be at the perfect temperature. Oh, it's incubating. I have one minute. Let me, uh, I have, I've made electricity. Yo, I'm Tesla out here. Let's go. Okay, here we go. Uh, 20 seconds. This is really like all over the place. Unfortunately, the bloody ocean is like... A complete waste of time. I thought there would be more than that, but I haven't discovered anything. Come on, keep it coming. Three, two, one. God damn. Right, can I turn this off? Right, turn off. Amazing. Uh, imprint. Name your Lystrosaurus. Lysto wants care. Right, let's feed you some food. Can you follow me, please? Let's get your head out of the machine. Look at it, you chubby boy come here wants carrot so he'll grow up to full size in about an hour let's go take him to the pen with the rest of them well we got a new addition to my family you know we should probably start thinking about breeding some other dinosaurs as well i mean having an army of these dudes would be pretty funny but like so you should be okay actually to be honest as long as you got food you should be all right what if we try can we what can we what can we have an army of i want an army of something different we want an army of big ones. You know what, yeah? I have not taken this guy out to do absolutely anything. And you know what? I, I kind of prefer the Allosaurus compared to the T-Rex. Like, I'd rather go with them than that. Perhaps maybe we get a, just get a, a, a female Allosaurus. The oceans are very disappointing. Um, just like they are in the real world. I need metal. I ain't got enough metal. We need to get metal. We're going back, boy. I've... You... You... I've done a madness for me. Right, back to the mountain as we go. This seems familiar, doesn't it? This is what I've had to do, by the way, in order to get, like, more metal, more crystal. Like, I've literally just had to go to this mountain back and forth. Once again, we are all over the place this episode. Well, we've gone to the depths of the ski. The ski? <laughs> the depths of the sea. And here I am, in the heights of the sky. And, man, my English is terrible. So one lot in there, and the other half in here. I might actually multitask as well, actually. I don't know if that will be a problem, but it might give me gasoline and metal at the same time. We'll see. So as we wait for uh, the metal to cook, let's... Uh, God damn, bro! Man grew up! Go, oh, look at him go! Right, we got a new addition. Oh, they're gonna mate in 35 minutes if I ain't careful. Okay, cool, fair enough. We have a new addition to the family. Let's give you some more HP, some more stamina. I don't know, maybe you think we can have just like... I want to create like a stage, and then obviously I can make them do like a little circus. Go up and down. We gotta wait for metal to cook anyway, so we may as well just like go and just do some random stuff, why not? Expect the unexpected. Hang on, why am I picking my hands? I have this sickle in my inventory. Unfortunately, we can't get like raided by dinosaurs, like we can't have anyone like attack us, so 
There's no way actually to demonstrate if any of these animals are capable of defending against such creatures unless like I, I, I move them in. But I'm not going to walk around this entire whole island with a whole army of all these dinosaurs behind me because you know most of them are going to get stuck. Some of them won't even be able to go to certain places and, and all in all it's just absolutely just useless. Like I've only taken like probably three or four dinosaurs across this, this place with me and everything else, everyone else has all just been sat here. Not really doing anything, but then again, there's not much they can do. Like, we don't get attacked, unless it's the bloody rain. And, like, we don't get, like, there's not, like, an opportunity to, like... Like, I haven't even made any defenses. Like, there's no reason to. I mean, obviously, multiplayer is probably the only reason, but obviously, I don't have any friends. And playing with strangers is, like, the worst idea you could ever do when it comes. Especially to games like this. It's raining inside my house as well. Here they come. Look at look at the squad. Look at the squad. <laughs> Bro, imagine imagine you know you're on the fields, you know, you're in the meadows and you know you you you're having a picnic with your wife and all of a sudden you just come along and you just see all these just coming over. <laughs> all right, let's get them in here, shall we? Not exactly a stage. It's more of a bloody love shack. Amazing. Okay, uh, new idea, new idea, new idea. Um, okay, I'm actually gonna make, like, a, in, instead of, like, I'm gonna see if I can make them, like, um, the idea is to make, like, a, what do you call it, a pen. There we go. Jesus, why did I struggle so much with that? So the idea is I can pretty much see, look and see, really, and obviously if I want to get in, uh, what do I need for, like, a ladder? I need more thatch. Okay, hang on. Okay, I've made a ladder in. So if I just set you guys, uh, enable wandering, you guys just gonna do your own thing? Enable wandering. Okay, so these guys should just walk around, I guess. Bruh, they're having... They're mating again. Um, well, be happy about it. Bruh, how many kids, fam? Okay, they're just mating again. Right, fair enough. Um... Well, it, it don't really matter because obviously I've got the conditioner machine now, so I, it doesn't matter about the temperature anymore. So yeah, but we can make kids left, right, and center. Once again, all over the place today, but uh, let us make a saddle. Equip you on. Oh, bro, you got 15 levels. My guy's just been sitting around doing nothing. Yo, they got another one. Is it fine? That's too hot right now. Uh, pick up. Make another child. Like, bro, is that easy? Is it? Is it doing anything? It's still too hot. How does this work, then? Unfortunately, I don't have a way to actually see what the temperature is. Hang on, if I press H. The temperature is 43 degrees. I think it just must be one of the days where it's just too hot at this point. I am once again putting another child on standby. And until we are graced with a chance to meet again, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell. And until the next time, where um, we'll go on an ex exploration with Alan and... Um, We'll obviously check in and see how my army is doing. I feel like we might need to just go and take these out and take these out and see how these guys fare against the creatures that face us. Uh, but that is something we will do next time. So until then. <laughs>